Hi guys, welcome back. Um, I'm Ash, I do short walks in interesting places. And today I'm in Tenerife. I'm at the Coral Los Alicios Apartments. Um, I'm just gonna show you a room review. So we're in, we're in block B 203. Um, so you've got parking, parking down here. Front of the hotel is just, just kind of here you've got like a parking lot along the, along here and then if we just come in come into the room hopefully that road won't be too noisy but if we come into the room I'm thinking there's quite a lot of space so bedroom first It's a decent, decent size. Good amount of wardrobe space as well. And then we've got ceiling fans, so there's no aircon in here. This is being filmed in February, so I mean we're here, we're here 29th of February. So hopefully we won't need aircon. But if you're here in the summer, that's probably one thing to look out for. Um, but these things work. We've we've been in coral apartments before or coral hotels before. Um, and I can only recommend them. Decent, decent hotel group in my opinion. Uh, good value for money, um, and the rooms are always a pretty decent standard. Uh, so yeah, cu couple of beds here. New rucksack, as you can see, absolutely like rammed. Um, but this is this is a brand new rucksack. The last one was getting a bit tatty and getting holes in it, so this is a brand new one. And Leanne's got the same. Hello, hello. No worries. Oh, cool. Thank you. Cheers. Gracias. Thanks a lot. Uh, yeah, so just just had a delivery of uh, cooking equipment. Couple of pans. Um, so yeah, that's that's pretty good. So yeah, so self-catering apartment, but bedroom here. Next thing along this corridor is the bathroom. Uh, again, pretty decent size. Hi guys. And then walk-in walk -in shower, uh, which, which looks, yeah, power shower. That looks pretty good. So all of the Coral Hotels, they're, they're pretty similar. Um, so we last year we, uh, May we stayed at the Compostela Beach, uh, cracking location in Las Americas, um, just down opposite the Oasis Center, not too far from the fountains and the far Safari Center, and kind of right next to Las Vistas Beach. So you've got Chuck E's, McDonald's, Sun King, all of those places, um, and this is very very similar uh, to to that. This is in Los Cristianos. Um, which is a new place for me. I've not stayed in Los Cristianos before. So we're looking forward to exploring. But yeah, bathroom, bathroom's pretty good standard. And then you walk through and you've got this, this lounge, kitchen, kitchen lounge that's like, I don't know if you can see on the video, but this is, this is huge, much bigger than it kind of needs to be. But, uh, but yeah. Lots of space, lots of space in here. Obviously we've got the microwave, kettle, fridge, coffee machine, cups and saucers, sink. You've got a couple of hobs, couple of electric hobs here. Toaster, the ladies just brought those, those pans. You got a few more in there. I'm guessing cut, cutlery maybe. So this is the first time that I'm looking in all of these. So you've got all of your, all of your implements. Let's see what's under the sink. Yeah, bin, all pretty standard. Glasses, crockery. And is there anything in the fridge? Nothing in the fridge. 
not ice cube holder. Not that I expect there to be, but you never know. Might be a complimentary bottle of water or something. So yeah, massive, massive living room. TV, you've got, you've got Wi-Fi here. Um, so we've got instructions on how to set that up. And then you come through and you've got, again, I don't know if you can see this on the video, but you've got, well, you can see, you've got a pretty decent sized balcony as well. Uh, with a pool view. Yeah, lady, again. Oh, okay. So yeah, pool view and a sea view as well. So yeah, nice, nice big balcony. Anybody there? But yeah, Leanne, what do you what do you think? Really nice, yeah. Much bigger room than we've had before. Yeah. They could have this is superior for It's huge. If they could put a yeah, it's kind of twice the size that, like, than it like needs to be, isn't it? In the lounge, um, it'd be perfect. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's huge. Um, yeah, outside space is really big as well. Pool, happy yeah. with the pool, aren't we? Happy with the pool so we, we, we got here about midday. Yeah, it's nice. And then we were sat by the pool, had a couple of drinks, had lunch. We stored our luggage in the baggage room. Yeah. Like as with all coral hotels, mm. there's always a locker room. Really handy. Um, and they're always, if you arrive early, they're just like, yeah, put your stuff in, get changed, use the toilets, use mm. the changing room, get yourself a drink, sit by the pool. They're kind of very, it's organized, very really. organized. So yeah, no, I like it. But I'd say this is very similar to say Compostela Beach. Mm. Family friendly. Family friendly. The rooms are yeah. But I don't know if you could, I don't know if you could, well, there are families here, so maybe in the family rooms they have got sofa beds. Yeah. I don't know, but the rooms are huge. And but, the outside space is big as well, so. Yeah, but different to say like Coral Suites, which is adults only, a mm. little bit more exclusive, rooftop, rooftop terrace. Uh, pool on the roof, more expensive. Yeah, probably, prob probably the most, Im not the most important, but the difference between the two is obviously the price, isn't it? Family friendly, um, huge room. I mean, if you're coming, I mean, this, you know, it's a bit rough around the edges, but yeah, it's not what you want as holiday. It's absolutely fine. Yeah, so we've so for five nights we've paid four hundred and ten pound, so it's less than a hundred. That, that was the cheapest we wanted. Yeah, and this it's cheapest we could find. And this is 29th of Feb, so it's like the week after half term. Um, so I don't know what that works out at. Eighty-five pound a night, something like that. So it's not. We've, we've got a visitor. It's not too bad. Yeah, and this is not a, this is not a pigeon. I've been informed these are in fact doves. Uh, a little bit more socially acceptable than the pigeon. Yeah, and pretty tame as well. Must be my aftershave, they come flocking. But yeah, first impressions. We're pretty happy, aren't we? Yeah. So yeah, I hope, I hope you've enjoyed this room review. If it's helped, fantastic. If not, it's a shame, but you're still watching. Um, Please hit subscribe. Please give the videos a thumbs up. Um, obviously, trying to trying to build. I'm on about four four hundred and fifty.
subscribers so I've, you know i've got a few more to go but yeah trying to trying to get as many as possible but yeah hope you've enjoyed the room review hope this gives you a bit of an insight um and yeah thanks for watching catch you on the next one